Well, I'm finally doing another color changers video for you guys. It's been so long since I did my last one. And on today's table, we've got five of them. Of which I am very excited about. Because Cryptid Buster McQueen, it seems like he was released like 15 years now, to my knowledge. Or actually, not really my knowledge. It feels like it's been that long. And we've got, like, quite a few others as well, like Royce Revsley and Sheriff. I wish I had trouble finding both of them in the stores. As for the Cruising McQueen right here, it took, like, about 15 minutes for him to successfully scan through. And DJ. Yep, DJ. As well, DJ. I've heard has been very difficult to get through the scanners at your Target stores. But I ended up getting this McQueen here for $2. Not joking. $2. You may think, wow, that's pretty sweet. But I don't think that applies to every Target USA store. I think that applies to just the ones that have them, is the point. Alright, so, enough talking. Or actually, now that I mention it, we did have color changers of Cruise and Lightning McQueen and Sheriff before. But they had different color changes. So I can grab them. As you can see here, this sheriff goes from blue to black, and this sheriff goes from blue to, or black to red. You could pretty much tell which one's which. I mean, there's no need to purely describe which one's which. Yeah, I showed them off in my live stream, if you like to check that out. I recorded it not too long ago, that live stream, or I posted it live not long ago. And as for Cruising McQueen here, this is the 2021 version. Yeah, and this one goes from red to yellow. This one goes from black to red. Yeah. Sort of nice how they're doing variation color changers now. I mean, for like DJ here. We're going to go over the packagings, then we'll open them. Here's Cryptid Buster Lightning McQueen. Pretty crappy without the gear, if you ask me. Though I can kind of understand why they didn't put gear on him. Cryptid Buster Lightning McQueen. Color changers. Yeah. Green and red. Voice Revsley. Yeah, the packages for... I mean, the package for Royce Revsley is pretty damaged. Royce Revsley changes from, like, orange to yellow. Yeah, I got this from Amazon, so that's why it has the sticker and the packaging is a bit damaged. Color changers, Royce Revsley. Yeah. Pretty cracked up package. So I won't mind opening that. Because I don't have an extra color changer. Which that's okay. The Sheriff. Sheriff. Giving me flashbacks of when I first unboxed this one. Oh, I thought that was a spider, but no. It's actually part of the packaging. I know that Mattel did one back in, like, 2010, but it was a bit of a darker blue. So, yeah. 
This one's much lighter blue. Again, this one came from Amazon. Here's the Cruisin' McQueen. Again, gives me flashbacks of when we got the black and red one. Now this one's a little bit different. Yeah, it's... Yeah, the colors have been trying to change, but yeah. Not really... Doing it. Not really doing much color change in action going on. So hopefully that's all gonna change, you know? Cruising Lightning McQueen. I think that's probably the Thailand promotional image. Don't know. And lastly, we've got Mr. DJ here, the color changers DJ. Now, the Cruz and McQueen and DJ are from 2024, so that's why I'm probably going to put 2024 in this video, because why not? As you can see, he changes from like a lime green to a blue color. They did a DJ back in the day, but it wasn't like these two specific colors. It was more like a blue, dark blue to a lighter blue. So yeah. I haven't done this in a while, so we're going to crack these color changers open. Actually looks kind of cool, not gonna lie. The Cryptid Buster McQueen. I'll put him right there. Royce Revsley. Looks pretty nice, you know. Careful now. There he is. Cruising McQueen. Odd that we're doing two McQueens in this video, but he's a pretty popular character. What can you say? He actually looks pretty cool out of that package. Not gonna lie. But kind of weird at the same time. Then we've got DJ here. Now that I got these guys out of the package, I'm gonna go get some water, eh? I'll be right back. All right, now that I got my water out, it's time to test these guys. So, I'm gonna line them on up. All right, Cryptid Buster McQueen, you're up first. Hopefully that scratch doesn't indicate anything wrong with you. So yeah, best of luck. I'm gonna roll up my sleeves so that way I don't get wet. Hey, you know, actually changes pretty cool. That's actually pretty smart. Actually pretty nice. How he changes from like a green to this like red color. Kind of, I mean, although it's not the accurate shade, I can live with it. Like it's a, it's a bit of a darker red per se. Which I'm fine with. But man, these color changers are really, really awesome. Kind of like a Cryptid Buster McQueen with no gear. Alright, so back in the cold. Uh, some parts of them are just not changing, you know? 
Uh, it's probably because he's been in the package for quite a while. Yeah, that's probably the reason. Over there. All right, so Royce Revsley. Now, this is an interesting one because some people say he's like the color changer flow and the Cars to McQueen. Like, he doesn't have his usual red color. I think they were intending to do the red color, but they just could not get the shade right, I don't think. I think this is sort of like a Royce Wesley shade. Looks pretty cool. All right, so we're going to dip you in there. Man, I love having fun with these color changers. I really do. Let's see if he actually changes to yellow. And success! He does. Looks pretty awesome. In yellow, Mr. Royce Revsley. I would not be surprised at all if they did a Gearston Marshall or even Nile Speed Cone color changer. Because Salt Flats racers are really, really popular. In, like, anyone's opinion. All right, gonna go back on the cold. Ready. Ugh. You can barely even see the decals that are in yellow now. But they're still there. Yeah, they're still there, guys. Don't worry. Back in the ice. Just like that, he changes back to orange. Pretty spot on. All right, we're going to do Sheriff now. This one changes from like a blue to blue, black. I'm going to grab the other Sheriff first. So you can see that changes from like red to black. Yeah, there is the red. I mean, the Sheriff. Eh, not changing the sides. Yeah, this was one of the ones that I reviewed back in 2021. If you like to see that review or video, you can check that out. Now it's getting to be 2024. Wow, time sure flies, doesn't it? Oh, sorry. Mr. Lightning. Let's see if this sh sheriff changes to a blue color. And he sure does. Wow. That sheriff is rocking it in blue. Two different variations of Sheriff Color Changers. Wow. Hopefully I can look for them in stores. Or hopefully they appear in my store soon. Because I've been wanting them desperately. And now I finally have them. But I had to order them on Amazon. Which sucks. It really, really does. I'm going to change you back into the black color. There we are. Yeah, you can pretty much tell that there are different shades of black by looking off the camera. Or you can kind of tell on the camera, too, that there are different shades of black. Now, they released a green share for Cars 2, but I decided not to bring that one out at the moment. All right, so we're going to do this Cruise and Lightning McQueen. Against this Cruising Lightning McQueen. Gonna dip this one in the warm water. Yeah. This one's got a bit of damage around its mouth area. That is not ideal at all. Uh, dip this one in the warm water. And oh my god, that actually looks so beautiful! Gotta admit, that looks so cool! Oh my god, that looks amazing! It really, really does. Spot on, Mattel. You've done wonderful with these color changers. You really have. Done wonders with them.
now into the cold. Yep, he changes to a red color. Seems that the color changer, the newer version, is a bit more of a brighter red. Yeah, the color changer, the newest one, is a bit of a brighter red, as you can see on the camera. Uh-oh, it seems like this McQueen's got a bit of a chip. Uh, that's kind of a problem with these color changers, how they, like, get chips and stuff. That's kind of the norm with them, honestly. All right, DJ. Now, DJ. I cannot wait to see him in this lime green color. I can't. Let's go. And let's go indeed we shall. He is rocking that lime color. You go, Mattel. This looks stunning. It really, really does. Giving me vibes with that snot rod color changer. It really does. Looks beautiful in the lime. Really, really does. Now back into the cold he is. Again, looks very beautiful. These color changers, they really do. All right, so that is going to be, like, pretty much it for this color changers video. I know it was kind of short for a color changers video, but hey, what do you expect? You know, they're fun, the color changers. They're really, really fun to play with, honestly. And let me know if you found these color changers down in the comments, because I would certainly love to know. And for fun, let's bring out some more. Yeah, why not? Yeah, we'll bring out a few more. Let's get, um, hmm. Yeah, I decided to bring out a few more. This video is already kind of McQueen heavy. We got H.J. Hollis. Sort of like a lemon yellow like the Cruz and McQueen. Changes back to green. Got Mater. Yeah, changes back to purple almost instantly, this one. Bobby Swift. Mattel has released a lot of color changers. And I'm also planning on to buying that Rusty's Racing Center playset with the Rusty's Racing Center McQueen. Since I never got the fabulous one. Racer Snot Rod. Doesn't really change to like the specific white color, but it's fine. <laughs> Gonna do the Hudson Hornet now. Fun fact, actually, the one from blue to black was canceled. Or actually, it was a factory custom. My mistake. Wow. These color changers are lovely, and you need to purchase them, even if you're not a Cars fan. Trust me, they're fun. Anyways, guys, that's going to be pretty much it for the color changers of Cryptid, Buster McQueen, Royce Revsley, Sheriff, Cruising McQueen, and DJ. And also, I forgot to bring out the Salt Flats Racers. Damn. Yeah. Well, here they are, folks. Here they are.
And Royce Revsley looks wonderful with these guys. He really does. Against the blue and purple of Datch, Jammin, and Revo Cause. Anyways, guys, that's going to be pretty much it for this video. I don't know what ne what the video will be next, since I'm thinking of kind of taking a little bit of a break since the holidays have just been making me slammed with videos and stuff. So I think it's wonderful if I should take a break for a few days. See you whenever, I guess. Goodbye. Thanks for watching. And as always, peace.